survivors were in hiding. Intelligence reports a possible Alderanian convoy heading to Fostar Haven. You are to draw them out and finish them off. Do you understand that, Captain? Perfectly. Commodore Sloan. Dismissed. propaganda. They're traitors, not refugees, and will be dealt with accordingly. I've prepped our usual Sigma-9 loadout. No. Only standard ties today. Flying old school, sir. This might be a real challenge after all. Yes, 
Squadron and Doc can clear for hyperspace jump. Remember, Helix, we'll have support, but finding the refugee convoy is up to us. They won't escape the Empire twice. Let's go, baby. Woo! Target the uh, ship in question. We, we, we have always been loyal to the Empire. Scanning. See, we're loyal. I swear. No refugees aboard. Carry on. Good. Check that ship next.
through the station. The refugee convoy must be hiding in there. After them. We'll deal with you later, station master. You attack my station and customers, then blame me. Imperial thugs. There. The convoy. Prepare to fire. Schism. And protecting them makes me a rebel. And so be it. You are a rebel scum, bro. Damn it! Pilot, see if you can bypass his shutdown. How do I do that? Mash it. Mash any button. Mash it. Catch up with that traitor! Thank you. 
That was an Imperial transmission on an open channel. Go squadron, move in and give them cover. I find someone heard my distress call. I couldn't hold off those ties any longer. Who are you? A defector? If you'll take me, call me Linden. I'll explain later. Pilot, help me push these fighters back. Legal Ford, leave that quasar for now. Focus on ties.
wait. The Star Destroyer will be watching all possible vectors. They can still find you. Pilot, it's risky. But if we can destroy the targeting system on the Vigilance, we might throw them off the convoy's trail. Wait, you two are attacking the Star Destroyer? Let's go do it. of the Rebel Alliance have chosen to keep fighting to show right, the baby. Empire that we are not afraid. We are not afraid, baby. It was their bravery that ended Palpatine's reign and brought about our new Republic. Yes. However, the Empire lives on, shattered though it may be. As I speak, Imperial forces are edging toward the Bormia sector, hoping to end our new Republic before we find our footing. As their Empire collapses, they try to tighten their grip. But the galaxy is changing, and you can be a part of it. With the help of brave and daring pilots, yes. this war can end. Make a choice. Fly with the New Republic. Yes. Change our galaxy yes. for the better. What the? So first, let me start by saying that obviously, as you can tell by the game footage, that I'm not really a gamer. And usually first person games or that first person view usually makes me dizzy where I can only play the game in about 10 to 15 increments before I start to get dizzy. However, I did not get any of those effects from playing this particular game and I did play it for well over an hour and I felt totally fine. So that is an excellent, excellent sign 
for this particular game. I also thought that the controls for the game were really, really good and cool. Uh, not sloppy at all. I was able to kind of handle them, even though I haven't really got the gist of going between uh, my the different modes and uh, trying to repair the ship. And, you know, I haven't uh, quite got that down yet, but I still do like the controls for this particular game. The graphics are excellent, uh, very comparable to Battlefront 2. Uh, so I enjoy that aspect of the game as well. As far as the story, I think the story is really cool. I think it's great. I love having to go between the two sides of uh, obviously the Empire and then the Rebels. And now it looks like for the second part of this, we're going to go in between the New Republic and the First Order. So really cool game. I really am enjoying the story mode thus far. I have yet to venture onto the multiplayer mode or the open world mode uh, for this game. I'm not sure when I will start that portion of the game. But for now, I'm going to continue with the story mode and see how far it's going to go and where it takes us. I am really enjoying it thus far, as I had mentioned. So, guys, let me know what your thoughts are in regards to the game. Have you picked up Star Wars Squadron? Have you played the story mode? Have you entered in the multiplayer mode, guys? Let me know and put those comments down below. Please like and subscribe and of course guys from the father to the son to the ob1 force ghost may the force be with you always